This time, we will be discussing about the parabola with vertex at 0, 0 that opens downward. And again, the standard equation is x squared equals negative 4ay. So we have now the parabola with vertex at point of origin, but this time, the opening is downward. So the standard equation now will become x squared equals negative 4 a y. So kung kanina, it opens upward, the equation is 4ay. Ngayon, dahil downward siya, it becomes negative. So this is the sketch of the parabola that opens downward with vertex at 0, 0 with this given standard equation. So we have the vertex at 0, 0 or point of origin and the distance between the vertex and its focus is equal to a. Since our parabola opens downward and its vertex is at point of origin, that means our focus will be along, uh, will lie along the negative y-axis. So, nasa loob ng curve yung focus natin, doon yung focus nasa negative y-axis. And since the movement is vertically downward from the vertex, so, ang nabago lang again is the y-coordinate. So, from 0, 0 ng vertex, it will become 0, negative a. Negative kasi the movement is downward, vertically downward. So, 0, negative a. Still, the distance is a. Now, to determine the value or the coordinates of the endpoints of the lattice rectum, Titingnan naman natin ngayon, magsimula tayo sa focus. So, from the focus to the left end point of the lattice rectum, we move 2A to the left. Since we move to the left, that means we subtract. So, minus 2A. So, ang movement natin is horizontal going to the left. So, from 0, negative A, this becomes now negative 2A negative a. So this is the coordinates of our endpoint of the lattice rectum at the left side. And on the right side, the right endpoint of the lattice rectum is again from the focus you move 2a to the right. Positive kasi to the right. At ang nabago lang, ang movement ay horizontal. So x coordinate ng focus. So this becomes now positive 2a negative a. So, these are the, the coordinates of the endpoint of the data spectrum on the, left, uh, on the right side. So, this is our vertex focus and two endpoints of the lattice rectum or parabola that opens downward with vertex at 0, 0. Now, again, y-axis is our axis of symmetry. So, therefore, it must be there must be a directrix that is perpendicular to our y-axis. And the directrix is behind our curve. Since the opening of our parabola is downward with vertex at point of origin, that means behind the curve, our directrix should be perpendicular to the positive y-axis. And the distance again between vertex and the directrix is also equal to a. And therefore, the equation of our directrix will be y equals a. So again, this is the sketch of our parabola with vertex at 0, 0 that opens downward and the standard equation is x squared equals negative for a y. And so let us now sketch the parabola given the standard equation x squared equals negative 8y. So as you can see, our given standard equation x squared equals negative 8y. So kahawin siya ng standard equation ng parabola that opens downward. x squared equals negative 4ay. So as you can see, the coefficient here of y is negative 8. So that means our negative 4a is negative 8. Now, 
Ano yung ibig sabihin ng negative? Again, it it just simply tells us that the parabola opens downward. But then sa pagkuha ng value ng a, kinukuha lang natin yung mismong value a, no? So we use this to equate from 4a. So 4a equals a. So again, dinisregard na natin yung sign kasi alam na natin na yung sign nagsasabi lang siya kung ito ay upward or downward. In our case, this is negative. So that means our parabola will open downward. So 4a is equal to 8. So that means a is equal to 2. So that means the distance between the vertex and the focus is 2 units. And then, sinote ko na rin dito yung value ng 2a dahil gagamitin natin siya mamaya para sa lapis or 2. So our a is 2 and our 2a is 4 units. Okay. So, since our parabola has a vertex at 0, 0, and it opens downward, let us now identify or locate our focus. The distance between vertex and parabola, eh, vertex and focus rather, is equal to 2. Since this is downward, that means from the vertex, we're going to move 2 units downward. 2 units vertically downward. So this is 1 and this is 2. So this is negative of the negative y-axis or of the y-axis. So that means this is our focus. Gumalaw na tayo vertically downward. So that means the coordinates of our focus would be equal to 0 negative 2. This is now the coordinates of our focus for this equation x squared equals negative a y. So after locating or determining the focus, let us now determine next the endpoints of the lacus recto. So let us first identify the coordinates of the endpoint of the lacus recto at the left side. So from the uh, from the focus, we move two a or which is equal now to four four units to the left. So if we move four units to the left, that means we subtract and we are moving horizontally to the left. Ang mababago na may ang x coordinate ng focus. So from here up to here, that is four units. Okay. So that means the coordinate of this endpoint of the lattice rectum at the left side would be, since this is negative, so negative 4, negative 2. This is the coordinate of our lattice rectum at the left. And on the right endpoint of the lattice rectum, again, we move 4 units to the right, this time to the right. So that means, if we're going to the right, it will be plus 4. So the coordinates now of our endpoint of the dot spectrum at the right side will be 4, negative so, nakita agad natin yung uh, values o yung coordinates ng lattice recto. Hindi na natin equal. Okay. So, we can now construct or draw the curve. So, let's say that is our curve. Okay. So, the curve or the parabola opens downward. So, we have the focus and the two endpoints of the lattice recto. And this time, let us now identify the equation of the directrix. Sabi natin, it is behind the curve. So, that means it should be perpendicular with respect to positive y-axis. And the distance between the vertex and the directrix is also the same as the distance between the focus and vertex. So that is A or 2 units. 1, 2. So we're just simply going to draw a horizontal, a horizontal line because it should be perpendicular to our 
axis of symmetry, or in this case, the y-axis. And then let's make it a broken line. And this will be now our directrix. And the equation of our directrix would be y equals. So this is the sketch of our parabola for the standard equation x squared equals negative ay. Our parabola opens downward with vertex at 0, 0 with the focus at 0 and negative 2. And the two endpoints of the lattice rectum of our parabola are negative 4, negative 2, and 4, negative 2. And the equation of the directrix of our parabola is y equals 2.